Hi, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can translate the whole web page from your Samsung internet on the Galaxy S21 series. First, tap on the home key to go back to your home screen, and then tap on the Samsung internet app. In here, you want to tap on the menu key, and from the pop-up menu, tap on add-ons, and then tap on translator, and this will take us to the Galaxy Store, which will allow us to download an add-on. Now tap on the install button. And if you do not have the internet, it will say something is wrong. So you need to have an active internet connections to download. So I'm going to try it again. It is around 11 to 12 megabytes. Okay, once it has downloaded and installed, you can tap on the open button and in here turn on translator so tap on the switch to switch it on and then tap on allowed now you can also tap on the add-on settings and in settings you can download the language that you want to use so here i have already downloaded german and arabic you can go down the list here and select a language that you want to use now at the moment, there is not a lot of languages available, only a handful. So just choose the one that you uh, you want to use. And after that, you can go back to your viewing web page. So tap on the back key and open up a web page. And in here, we're going to um, try to um, translate. Okay, so I have this web page loaded. Now, if you want to tr translate it to another language, you tap on a menu key, and then tap on translator, and then tap on translate page to a language. So at the moment it has set to English. So I'm going to tap on settings, and I'm going to choose translate web pages to, and then choose a language that you have downloaded. So for example, German. Now, if you go all the way down to the bottom, make sure you turn on show translation buttons on web pages. And now I'm going to go back here, and if I um, if I go down, you can see there is a bar that I can tap on to translate. So if I choose German, you can see the pages now automatically change, changes to uh, German language. And if I choose another language, so I can choose Arabic, and now you can see the page will slowly change to Arabic. And as you scroll down, the page will automatically translate to um, Arabic. So it may take a little bit of time, maybe there's a delay, a second or two delay, but eventually it will uh, translate the page for you. This is really handy because you do not need to copy and paste text. It's everything on the page will automatically get translated, which is really, really great and handy and helpful. Now, if I bring it down a little bit, so in order for the toolbar to show up, make sure that you are focusing on a text section. If you go to the image section, sometimes the toolbar does not show. So when we go to a text section and just wait for a second or two, the toolbar will come up. Now if you tap on the drop down, you can choose another language. However, if you haven't downloaded before, it will prompt you to download the language file uh, for the translator to work in that selected language. And that's it. So I'm just going to choose it back to English. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.